among my books, this one, Fearful Pleasures by A.E. Coppard, Card and X Library Coffee, and Arkham House uh, 1946 issue. So one of the earliest Arkham House ones. And in the introduction, what do we find? The very first line, I have not the slightest belief in the supernatural. If I should ever see a ghost, I should know it was time for me to consult an oculist, or better still, sign the pledge. Given that A.E. Coppard was a British writer and poet, it seems obvious that this was rewritten for an American audience. No British person would say oculist, they'd say optician. But there you are. Um, this is pretty nice. A.E. Coppard, if you don't know his work, was a British poet and author the, from the sort of 1920s through to, I think, the 60s. Uh, highly regarded by many, and a bit like D.H. Lawrence, a bit like, at times almost like Mervyn Peake, and sometimes like H.E. Bates, in the sense he's dealing with working class life in rural England quite often. But he also has flights of fancy. And as, as you can imagine, if there's an Arkham House collection of his work, he did write an awful lot of what class, what you can class as weird tales. A writer well worth seeking out, but not an easy, not an easy read, not an easy writer to get into. All the better for it, in my opinion. And that's A.E. Coppard.